Well, we've got a little visitor, Sharon. Yeah, number eight. Shall we show? Come in, number eight. After how many hours, Stacey? 56. 56 hours, look. Little baby butler is now here. Look. Wow. He's a little bunny boy. Any weighed, Stacey? £6.8.5. £6.8.5. Yeah. Ah, look. Mm. Little little dark hair. And that's you just had a little hold, haven't you? Frank, look. There we go, look. Come say hello to the baby. Ah. He waved to it. He waved to it. Frank. <laughs> so there he is. Frank. Little baby Charlie. 56 hours. This, this oh, yeah. is what real people look like when oh, yeah. they've given birth. Not with their makeup and their hair done. This is how people really look. Yeah, but what about him when he was just laying in the bed? He was in bed more. He was in the hospital bed more than you, Stacey. I've done 51 hours. He's done 51 hours. <laughs> there we go, people. That's little baby Charlie. First day. Is he a day old? No. No, 11, 15 tonight, 11, yeah, 11, 15 tonight. And they get you out of hospital that quick. You don't want to be stuck in a hospital. No, baby. So we're going to spend some time with baby Charlie and everyone else. And uh, baby Frank's happy playing with cars, Frank, isn't you? Dougal's got the right idea. Yeah, Merlin's been uh, introduced. Dougal's not really gone over, is he, at the moment? So, uh, yeah, they're just getting used to him. But as I say, we, we had these two dogs with uh, baby Frank when baby Frank was small, didn't he? Yeah. And he guards them. He loves them. Let's have a look. <laughs> Let's have a look. You got the baby, baby friend. <laughs> oh look, baby crying. Look. Say hi. Ah. Oh, baby Frank. Looking after the baby, baby Frank. Hey. Who's You're gonna this? look after him, Frank. Who's this Frank. Yeah. What's look. What's his name? Can you remember? Who? <laughs> Charlie. Charlie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> ah, baby Frank. Right, a little bit further on now, folks. We're in Horncastle now. We've got to stop off at Heron Foods, but we're first going to have a look at a charity shop. See if there's any DVDs Shops. in there. Shops. Shops, more than one. Yeah. It's about four here, isn't Unbelievable. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Here we are, first one, St Barnabas. Let's get inside and have a look. Oh, look around. I've seen the DVDs up here. Let's have a little look. Oh, hello. <laughs> no, there's a few there, but uh, nothing, for you. nothing really for me. A films I like to see, shout, but. Hey? Uh, no, well, I don't want to just collect loads of DVDs that I may watch. Who was that lady, shout? She came up and said hello, did she? I met her in Hagworthen and Butchers. She oh, said right. Hello to me there. Oh, right. She, she said, I know you. Hello, Martin. I thought, I don't know you. She said, Yeah, but I know you. <laughs> Most wanted. <laughs> Most wanted. Then, then you realised it was in Hagworthen and Butchers there. Yeah. Right, okay, so... Just um, like the Forgotten Tea Room. Just over there, look, the Forgotten Tea Room, never mind. A little bit further down now, we're going into the Butterfly Hospice. They were £55. Well, that box of shoes there. They should be worn to a wedding. And how much were they there? £7.50. £7.50, that's not bad, is it? Bad at all, sure. A lot of retro clothing in here, shall not there, look. Because some of that retro clothing now can, can be worth a lot of money, couldn't it? Well, go on in. You suit a hat. You the suit one? a hat, show me. Not that one. No, not that one, baby. <laughs> I don't like the colour of it, actually. Yeah, what about you? Hello, she's found something, she? What have you found? I'm at this. Hey? I'm looking at trousers. Trousers? Mm. Never mind. I think we, uh Coming here before, Sharon, I couldn't find any DVDs, could I? So coming out of that one and straight across the road, Sharon, is the um, Age UK. So let's go, where are you going? In we go. Three right next to each other. Alright, what are you looking for, Evie? Hmm? Let's have a look, see if we've got any DVDs in here. Oh, that was down there, weren't they? That's right, there's not a lot there, was there? Oh, that was it, three for 99 pence, wasn't it? Let's have a quick look through here, people. What's that one there? In this game, I don't know what that is. It's like a 3D box, look. Huh? What's that about then? Hmm, Harrison Forge in that one. Again, lots of uh, 
retro clothing. Look at these boots up here. Look. look at them. Look. Look virtually new. In fact, they still got the new stickers on them. Size eight. And how much were they then? Yeah, look, eight ninety nine. Look, you can't go wrong, can you? They are blink new. Look. Well, is. They look new as well, then well it's all pretty new anyway. Probably been worn once. 3 99 look at that look. You could buy them, sell them on eBay for about 15 quid. Well, anything? Mm. What? Oh hello, what you got there? Let's have a look. <laughs> what size are they? 38, that's a five in it. Prima Donna boots. Listen about how much are they? Just so people can see. $8.99. That's not bad, is it? Look at that, look. Hardly worn. I know there's a pair of boots over there which have not been worn, shall Size 8. My size. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Loads of women's clothes. I don't believe most of them in here are women's clothes, Sharon. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of pet of... Um, Leopard print. Leopard print shoes. Heel, I think that, I? Four yeah. pound forty nine. Look at that. Look. What was the name out of Corner Street? Bet Lynch, Bet wasn't Lynch, it? Yeah. Anyway, no DVDs for me, Sharon. Let's go. And right next to it is the Sue Ryder. <coughs> ah, a few DVDs in the corner. Yeah. I'll have a little look here, folks. And I'll come back to you. See if I've got anything. What you got there, baby? Star Wars Monopoly. How much is that? Six pounds. That's not bad, is it? Oh. All games on um, Amazon sell for about 20 quid, 21 quid, something like that. What have we got here? Here, Shell, what's this here? This ain't what we used to watch, was it? Shell? Is that what we used to watch? Because they've got them all. Oh, got them all. oh, you, you're getting excited, Shell. Is it the same? I don't know. Have a look here. That's just the complete first series there. I didn't know they'd done more than one series. Oh my God. How much are they then? Series two. I think that says three pounds. Is that series two? Fourth series third. Well, we didn't even know that that happened. Oh my God. Well, get them then. Get the whole lot. What are you Yeah. Why my dog's called Merlin? That's why you called Merlin Merlin, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm well happy. Like there you go. There you go. I've made her happy. Hey? Just take your shirt. Yeah, nice, aren't they? Look, a bit funky. A bit retro, I think they're. Uh, are they old originals? I don't know, there's no markings on them. Yeah, that's a nice one up here, look. £1.50. Hey? What? I think you might have bought a couple of that. That was £15 for that, look, wasn't it? Yeah. What have we got here, look? I think so. I thought I see Series 1 and Series I think 2. It's disc 1 and Disc 2. No, I'm not sure, sure. Yeah. I'll put my eBay. Hey? I'll put my well, eBay. If, if, if there are some doubles, yeah, that's all you've got to do, isn't it? Look at that. Because there'll be more fans like you out there, sure. Oh, yeah. Do you know what my brother's one? Of course he would. He Oh, he likes that, doesn't he? Yeah. Oh, well, that was handy, wasn't it, Sharon? I tell you, it's amazing the bargains you can get in the charity shops. Before, they used to have a stigma show, didn't they? People, well, I'm not going to shop in a charity shop. You get so many bargains in there. I know the prices have gone up now, but um, you still can get some fantastic bargains and stuff you don't normally see in like shops that sell new stuff for example like retro stuff and all that yeah just around the corner again in another one all <laughs> right oh, let's have a little look here i'm at the dvds again yeah i'll have that one there you go anything here takes your fancy only you baby oh look at you <laughs> yeah, that one on the corner is the British Red Cross, and pricing that are a lot dearer. Evie just wanted a set of her leggings, and they were new, but the price was ten pounds. It's a little bit too much for a charity shop, I think. Hence, there's no people hardly in this one. But you said there's one more, Sharon. One more. That's about five in total down this little high street, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Five, yeah. What ones are we going to? We've been in that one there, aren't we? The Sue Ryder. Well, that's Exactly. Right, we're in the centre now, shall we? Where the uh, the fountain is called. This is where they have the uh, the market during the week, isn't it? 
going now, isn't it? And they used to have a little cafe over there. It's yeah. been there for years and years, but it's uh, closed down now, isn't it? Yeah. You've got a Costa there. Costa Where? Coffee. Is that a Costa Coffee now? Yeah. I didn't even know that. It used to be a hardware store. That's right. And you reckon there's another hardware shop down here? Not a hardware no. shop. Um, charity. Charity shop down here. Oh, of course it is, just over here, look. Let's have a little look in here. Wow, I wonder if they're a real shoe show and they look like it, don't they? Mm. They're massive. Look at the size of that uh, TV screen there, look. That's a 26 inch TV. <laughs> hey? Okay. So this is a little, this is a little one, isn't it? What's that? What is that? That's a, a saw, isn't it? A little for hot wire, oh. cutting polystyrene, like a little press, isn't it? For or oh, is it a saw? It's a very fine fret saw by the looks of it. That goes up and down and cuts like thin stuff. Do you think, look, on cassette, Harry Potter. Listen to it. Didn't know they did that. Oh, I didn't. There you go. There you go. Oh, is that all got there? Let's have a little look in here. I'm not sure what's here. I'm looking for certain ones, people. Oh. And I don't think I can see them. I just <laughs> no, there's not many in there, is there? It's like a Blu-ray version. I don't get what the difference is between normal and Blu-ray. No, nothing there for me. Anything there? Again, it's like a step back in time show, and it's all retro, isn't it? Oh. Put on your dancing shoes. Look at that. Look. Eight pound. Those are a big pair of shoes. Look at them. Look. Ten pounds. Leather. Clarks's. Look at that. Look. Hey, what mirror? Hippopo rhinoceros. Hippopotamus mirror. Rhinoceros has got horns. Oh, rhinoceros, of course it is. Yeah. Look, yeah, what's this look? Sour rail. Stranger Things. £1.50. You said it's a TV programme, Shane. Yeah, no, what you got there? Don't go breaking my heart. Oh, that's, um, how much are they? Each. £2, yeah, they're asking. Pound status quo. Top pounds, I've got all them shit, I've got hundreds of them. Top, pounds. top dollar. <laughs> Let's just have a look here, hold on. Yeah, five pound tubular bells, Frank North Frank Ifield, Mike Oldfield rather. <laughs> Emerson Lake Palmer. Some uh, old stuff in there. Yeah. All the fiver. I've got that one. Yeah, they all look a bit worn as well down the around the edges. Yeah, nothing there for me, I'm afraid. Right, where are they gone? You okay then? Make our way back to the car. No, hair and foods. Hair and foods, okay. So we're in um, hair and foods at the moment, and they've normally got a good selection of um, vegetarian stuff here, but Sharon couldn't see it, so we asked a young lady. If she's got any uh, vegetarian food, she come up with what was it? The she come up with these. She come running up. She said, "Oh, I just found these, the southern fried chicken wing." Sharon said, "Would they be on the bone?" <laughs> Unbelievable. It chicken wings. Because it said chicken wings. Why, said, if you're vegetarian, do you want things called the same like chicken wings? That's your Why? brother, Sharon. Well, it's just that's general. like the bacon, isn't it? They want the yeah. it, it, they make it look like bacon, but it's not bacon. Huh. That, that's like chicken wings, but it's not. I can't believe you said. Are they on the bone? <laughs> Unbelievable. Your nanny. What a silly billy. Hey? What's wrong with her? She's a silly billy sometimes, your nanny. What? Freak. Unbelievable. Cool. Go on, off you go. What are you looking for now, Sha? Who's this for them? Don't no, you like tiger bread, Evie? No, that's for Harry. He didn't like tiger bread. It's, it's a bit uh, crusty, weird yeah. like that, we was eating it. Well, when we was, when we was eating bread, yeah. Come on in, baby. What do you mean? It's only for... Off you go. <laughs> well, yet another day, baby. Another day. And we're going out, not in your car, not in my car. We're going out in Jimmy's old transit van he just bought. <laughs> 
Yeah, so uh, I've got some work to do to this. We're going to put another door on it, but that'll be all on the uh, Retro Restore channel. Let's just open the door for a minute. It's only done just over 100,000 miles, I think 106,000 miles. It's a little bit tatty, but uh, I need to measure. Come around the back, shall I need to measure if I can get some wood in, some posts. I say it wants a good clear out and all that. Jim is going to be doing some body work on it because the wheel arches are a bit rusty just down there. So uh, that's all within Jimmy's capabilities. Right, hold that for a minute, shall Right, now it's got a bulkhead unit in there, so I need to get some posts in there, which are 2.4 metres. So let's have a little measure. See what we've got here. Uh, 2.1. 2.3, oh that's 2.4 there. Oh yeah, they're falling there, look. Oh, that's lovely. Lovely jubbly. So that's all right. Has that made your day? Yeah. That's good then. So, um, what we do, we go and get him some new oil and a filter for that, which I'm going to change on my Retro Restore channel. And any work we do to this fan, lucky enough, the rust underneath is not too bad, to be honest with you. I've checked all the points where I don't know my Retro Restore van, because I had a panel van like this from Transit. And I do so much welding, that's how I learned how to weld on that one. But um, I've checked all the end points and they're all pretty good. It does need a little bit of welding on the front. Do you know what you need? What? Air cut. Why's that then, baby? I'm just looking at it through the camera, then looking at it. Know, it's very it, wild. It grows so quick, doesn't it? So anyway, let's go to... Linco. Linco in uh, Boston. It's no, in Boston, Hong Castle. Hong Castle, sorry. And we'll get his oil and filter. He wants that changed. I'll do that for him. And um, then we can either go to the Ragged Apron. It's only quarter past ten at the moment. Have our breakfast or brunch rather, lunch really, isn't it? Yeah, I don't have. We don't normally have breakfast, but um, we'll have that, and then we'll go on to South Northkine and pick up the wood for that. And we'll probably take these one for the ride share. Oh, you're coming out and about with the battlers. Coming in, baby. Let's go. You're in a transit van again. Oh, no, I can't believe it. I've got to leave Lulu behind. I've had a lovely day with Lulu yesterday. But there you bye go. Bye, Lulu. Right, Sharon. Here we are. Now, Dow's here as well, people. And Dal, you've created your own uh, YouTube channel, which isn't out yet. You've got to do some content first, haven't yeah, you? I will be doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Some ragged content. Yeah. Ragged, ragged. <laughs> so get get ready because you'll be doing that very shortly. We'll let you know, people. And uh, yeah, Dal, as I say, we'll show you that when we get. It's at the. Is it the ragged apron or ragged apron? At ragged apron, right? So keep your eyes out for that one, folks. And uh, don't forget, when he does get it going, we we'll get a video done. Go over and subscribe to his channel and go and check him out. Do yeah. your poached eggs. Yeah, oh yeah, show him how you do your poached eggs and all that now. We're going to do a few cheats. Yeah, we're going to do a few cheats. <laughs> yeah, a few cheats and all yeah. this and all yeah. the bits behind here. All that type of stuff. People that... Right, are you taking orders or are you just yeah. you, want a, you want an autograph? <laughs> well, you're mine, yeah, Oh, here we go. Here we go. Right, go on, Michelle. What are you having? Right, I want to be a bit cheeky now. Go on. I want salad. But oh, can okay. I have the chicken burger? On the tight sort of ham today. Yeah, you only cooked and then shredded that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Without no bun, you don't want the bun there. No, no, he knows that. He knows that. Chicken, I'm going to put chicken salad. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I've been asked. That's what I do at home, so. You probably start cooking a burger and jumping that one. Four bits of bacon. Four bacon. Two poached eggs, and your boy does very good poached eggs as well. Excellent. And a burger as well. Without the bun, obviously. Excellent. Right, now, as you well know, a lot of you have eaten in the Ragged Apron before, and uh, I left a, a link on my community page for those of you who have eaten to go over and have a vote because there's a local competition in the Lincolnshire Life? Lincolnshire, Lincolnshire Live. Live, L-I-V-E. Yeah, it is, yeah. The boat for the best cafe in Lincolnshire. And um, anyway, you've got some news. The results are in now. We won't tell you what happened, but um, I'm sure you'll hear that uh, a bit later on. So we're not going to let the cat out of the bag either way because there was a lot of people taking part, and... Um, We'll wait until we uh, get the answer. Thank you, Dale. You right, Jess? I showed your chickens on the last video, Jess. Yeah. She don't know, Jess, don't watch our videos, people. <laughs> so I'm having my cafetiere show, but you've just got this. Now, I don't normally drink these drinks anymore, people, but this is Tango Mango, which I'm gonna have a go at. And Jess has kindly got them. Thank you, Jess. And Jess is the one with her chickens. We saw her chickens on the last video show, didn't we? She it's saved lovely. them. She yeah. saved them. And they've got a lovely hair now, haven't they? Or fur, rather. Feathers. Feathers, lovely. Lovely hair. <laughs> and also, Sharon, they're um, 
the eggs are fantastic. They started laying again, didn't they? Because yeah. they did, they weren't laying at first. Well, they've got to get used to their new surroundings, haven't they? Yeah. Used to freedom, basically. So I'm going to try one of these Tango Mango, Sharon. Because I've not had a Diet Coke or anything like that since the 1st of Jan, really, when I started all this. Um... You're going to have a taste explosion. Yeah, because I've been having fizzy water. I'll have that, but I've not had one of these. So let's have a little go at this. See, I, see I've forgotten how to drink fizzy drinks. I don't normally drink out of a glass, do I? It's nice to drink out of a yeah. glass. I normally just drink straight out of the can, so this is Tango Mango. Sugar free, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm just trying it. If you don't like it, I'll finish it. Actually, it's not too bad, is it? It's refreshing. Mm. On a hot day, that'd be really nice, if we ever get a hot day. Better because it's ice cold, Sharon. Yeah. Right, let's wait till we get our grub, and we'll see you in a minute. Oh, hello, there. I'll just tell you about your chickens, Jess. Oh, yeah. And they weren't laying at first, were they? No. And it's been about three or four weeks? Maybe five. When did they have... They were bald, weren't they? Yes. When they got them. I was trying to look for a picture. I couldn't oh, have you got a picture? Yeah. Oh, could you show us it so they can see what wonderful job you've I'll done? Send it, send it. Yeah. So I'll put it in the video. Yeah. That's what they look like, and we'll show you what they've done, how yeah. they look now, and that was about five weeks ago, Jess. Yes, yes. And they're now laying. Yes. Fantastic. Lovely. Thank you, Jess. No I like that. Hang on, man. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Tell it to keep buying it. I will. Luke aside. See you later, Jess. I do a lot of cafeteria as well. Bitter. Hey? Yeah, I drink it like that, Chad, don't I? Yeah, no. But you won't have it bitter. No, don't you? like bitter coffee. Tell us what they're like, folks. I've never had them. Coffee bags. Because I gather it's the same sort of gr 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 grinds, are they called coffee grinds? Grains. Grinds. Is it great? It's not like what you get on an instant coffee. Martin, powder. can I just say something? I'm not buying you coffee bags because you've got a no, coffee I'm machine. No, I'm just asking the people what it's like. Because I like a cafeteria as well. I know we've got the pods. And I don't even know what the price is like, shall how they can how they compare. Mm. So anyway, right, we'll see you in a minute, folks. I'm not going to have our dinner. Brunch, if you want to call it that, sure. Oh, well, there you go, baby. You've gone for your crispy chicken uh, salad there. And that looks absolutely lovely, Sharon. It's Fantastic. Going. You've got that as well, besides. You've got, yeah, you've got your salad, salad cream salad. and your beetroot there as well. And I've gone for two absolutely superbly poached eggs there. I've got me one bit of uh, one burger there, and also before bits of bacon. And just look at these eggs, folks. He, he does these to perfection every single time. Look at that, look. What about that free yolk? And that one's exactly the same, look. Absolutely perfect, look. Of course, Jess served the shell. Dow didn't realise he brought me out another cafeteria as well, didn't he? Mm. <laughs> Superb. We can eat these folks and we'll see you in another video i think we'll leave them here show so thanks very much hope you've enjoyed this video and uh, we'll see you in the next one and until then bye for now